Let's play Medieval 2 Total War. Playing with England, a short campaign, and this is the end of turn 1. Before I uh, end the turn, however, I will uh, make sure I have uh, all, the, all the construction done. And I will also uh, clear these queues a bit. I actually want to build roads there. Uh, roads everywhere. Uh, I decided to do that. Well, apart from mines here in London. Also, uh, double check that if I want to recruit anything, I do want those in Cayenne. And I think that is it. Uh, all the comments in the first video really helped me uh, keep, them, keep them coming. And one of them was that the merchant actually, actually works better uh, if if he's uh, far away from the capital. So working on these resources here right next to London won't be very good. Loading my wares aboard, sire. So I will take the... I shall continue tomorrow, my lead. We'll take the merchant to the continent or island, I think. And... Um, one other thing I learned from the comments was that uh, I should try to improve my relations with the Pope. So that's what the diplomat will be doing from uh, next turn onwards. Without question, sire. Go, uh, go south. I shall continue tomorrow, sire. Go south and uh, arrange meeting, meeting with the Pope. Hopefully uh, we'll get good relations with uh, His Holiness. And um, financial situation uh, looks okay now. Uh, a lot of money going to construction this turn. I will have to uh, look into this and have, uh, on the next turn uh, how, the, how the finances start to develop. And uh, in case you noticed, I, uh, I made the advisor text only. I uh, really liked her voice. She was helping me uh, quite a bit in the first video, but it was a bit interruptive to the commentary, so uh, I uh, made her text only and will will click on the question marks and her advice as I need it. Mm. I think that's... That's all I wanted to do here at the end of the first turn. I kind of did that on purpose, ended, uh, ended the first video before the turn changed, so uh, I could take on, on on all the advice I got. But yeah, I think uh, I think now I'm uh, I'm ready to ready to rock. The rebels in Rennes. Ride out and fight, Captain Robin. And if I recall, these rebels had a unit of mailed knights. Which shows in the army strength ratio, so I definitely can't automatically try to resolve this. Mm. Alright, we'll go to the battle. Yes, sire! We bring the battle to the enemy! Uh, well, the enemy kind of brought the battle on us, but uh, either way. Units, await my orders. I can see the knights coming there already. Um, I hope to uh, hope to be able to play without the boss later on. But uh, right now in, the, in this battle, I think I will need it quite a bit. The archers had the battering ram that I constructed, so I'm dropping that one. The captain is in the peasants squad, light infantry. I will try to welcome the knights. The spearman. Maybe three ranks. You will be. Hmm. Let's see how you how you set up there. I think you need to go a bit 
right here. This look right like that. Let's see how you set up the archers. Line up after you have left the battering ram. So you move there. Let's see what you do. Archers, are you ready? I would really like you to get in ranks, flame your arrows and shoot at those. There comes the knights. Maybe if I will try to shoot at the, at the militia with flaming arrows. The knights charge us on this side. Um, Hope I'll be able to flank them. So if I run there, uh, is there a brace spears order, or is it enough that I will test the guard? Shieldrum, I believe, is is kind of a circular formation. Please someone correct me if I'm wrong. I won't use it here, but I wonder, should I use the guard? I will. Good tidings. The huh. enemy general lies dead. We've sent the base cur to hell. Okay, so I guess the guard was a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> Enemy general dies on the charge. All right, I uh, can't really hope for a better beginning there. Um, am I shooting with you guys? Shooting at the spear militia. I really want you to go here. You are coming to the flanks of these guys. Um, I will wait. Look at that. Flank on the knights. You will go against those guys. Those guys are doing something. I don't know what they are doing. Uh, you guys go away from the guard. Well, the initial class was okay, but after that, not so much. I think I will need to try to take out these knights with the spearmen right now. I think you will need to go there. Uh, so many things happening. A bit confusing. They don't have they don't have general, but there's okay. The knights are rooted, but there's eleven of them left. Sixty-two spearmen rooted. Uh, they will probably come back. The crossbowmen are still. Uh, all right, let's put the flaming arrows there. Take the spearmen. Attack these guys who are here still standing. Shoot at the crossbowmen, please. Actually, wait. Go without the flaming arrows. Our men are under attack. We must act now. The battle seems to be swinging in our favor. From such tidings, does victory emerge? Yeah, but I do need to be a bit careful not to get over overconfident with these things. No, those guys. Mm, the 
these guys. Because they have a, they have a lot of units. Stop. Flaming ammo. Can you reach those guys? I mean, should I? Should I form ranks here? Well, not in that direction, I won't. Like, take, take on the enemy instead of chasing them. There comes the knights back. Charge at those guys. Archers forward here. Yeah, they are they are rooted, but there's a lot of them, and they will just they will come right back into the fight. Hope those guys will now get killed, because they uh, they get rooted, but there's a there's a lot of them. Archers are now there, ready to fight. Uh, I guess I should just kill them then. Try to kill them. Keep them all in formation. Shoot shoot and try to kill these guys. Uh, you can shoot at those guys. The enemy are badly bloodied. They have lost half their men. Uh, don't chase them. I'm just thinking will it, will this bite me in the ass in the end? I'm just chasing them. <sighs> there comes the knights again. The walls are no longer ours. The enemy have taken them. What? <laughs> all right, so let's all attack those knights then. If we could maybe take them out. Why don't you run through it? I'm not sure if this is a good idea. Should I have taken... Should I have stayed there in the... Yeah. <laughs> 
they are they are going going back there in the cent in the center and then uh, then running back. Come on. I guess there's so many of them left or something that The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Well, I certainly hope so. <laughs> I think this has been like that for quite some time. Thoughts. By St. George, last! Our men no longer command the city! What? At, at which point we commanded the city? My lord! Our My lord, we've lost control of the city! This is quite confusing. I uh, I think the fights would have been over already. <laughs> There's even a battle timer. Ah oh, no, that's the holding the plaza, right? The enemy army flees the field. Pursue and run them down. <laughs> There's one guy left. The enemy are utterly vanquished. <laughs> this is a great victory worthy of only the mightiest of generals. Well, they literally fought to the last man. Victory in your name, my lord. All right, this is uh, English soil now. Yes, it is, and I will occupy it. I won't go for the fast Florence. The Council of Nobles wants me to take Kair Narvon. I believe there is that place. End of turn report. Things are looking good. France has the biggest military. Dirt roads built in Anger, Sky and Nottingham. And I got my recruited troops. Well, that went well. Really well. The army, uh, not in such a bad condition. Can I... I can't retrain because there's no governor. I can't do it with the captain. Hmm. Okay, I uh, had to take a little break there from the game and uh, I checked or uh, educated myself about the retrain situation. 
that is related to the facilities available in the town. So this army could be retrained wherever I can train up uh, militia or peasant archers, which would be something like Khan. Actually, do I have any place I can train peasant archers? No, I don't. I just happen to have uh, those armies by default. Well, anyway, now this is uh, now this is the turn two. So let's see uh, what we'll do. Also, one other thing here, I am. Um, Kinda, kinda told myself about was um, was the faction relations. Now, if only I could find the find the right scroll for it. Ah, here the diplomacy. Um, I kind of wrongfully, wrongfully thought that we are actually in war against France and uh, the Scottish because of the description at the, at the very beginning when the campaign started. But the only thing we are at war against is the rebels and... Uh, the other factions are uh, not allied at the moment either. So now that I'm thinking of it, I um, if I could go back, I would uh, I would perhaps get that trade agreement with the with the French. But uh, it is gone now. I will uh, I will learn from it to the next game. On the other hand. They uh, won't get as much trade, uh, so hopefully that will help when I do go against them. And uh, here is the relations to the Pope, Pope Gregory of the Papal States, and our relations is here. It's kind of neutral at the moment. I will uh, be building, uh, building churches and other places of worship. Uh, to uh, get in good terms with uh, with the Pope. Your orders, sire. And uh, I talked about sending uh, sending the diplomat down south to meet with uh, meet with the Pope. But the first thing I hear now notice that uh, something I didn't really think about. You can't cross the rivers just anywhere. There are places places you can cross them, but you can't just go anywhere. Okay, that's good to know for the future. I will actually take the diplomat. Yes, sire. To uh, well, I will take him south. Let's uh, speed it up. We'll take him south, but I will take him south here to meet with uh, whatever nations we have here. I think the Spanish are here and the Portuguese, maybe something else, and uh, I will make some trade agreements. And if I see anything, anything on the way, uh, that'll be just a bonus. As you wish. Tomorrow's journey planned out, sire. And, um... Orders. You fellows here can uh, yes. fi finish your journey. And, um... Hmm. I will need to think about what I do with these... Uh, do with these uh, locations here. Because, uh, because Khan is here at the coast, I'm thinking of turning that into a town to uh, have maximum benefit of the coastal coastal city uh, with the trade, and then uh, maybe keep keep uh, Angus here as my uh, recruitment center as castle. Ren is uh, is a town already, and uh, in the Isles. I will very likely uh, eventually turn everything, turn every uh, every settlement into towns, but for now I think I will keep uh, keep Nottingham. 
and uh, going um, going to a uh, Carnarvon uh, will be my uh, priority because I got that as a mission, and that will give me twenty five hundred florins, which will be uh, quite useful. The question is, do I build anything? I will build roads to begin with. Can I go for height? I think I will... Um, hmm, show me the details. The public order isn't that, isn't that great at the moment, but... Um, There's quite a lot of unrest right now. It's probably why I should build a town watch eventually here. Maybe I will keep it. How oh, if I put it to a uh, if I put it to high? Still shows as. I will keep it at normal for now. I don't know how low the public order needs to go so that they actually start having some trouble with it. Right. How Orders. far can you go? With the roads, Robert here can reach Ren. So that's a good thing. What about these units? Sire. With the roads, they can, they can reach Angus. Alright, that's good. Can I recruit anything here? Mm, I'm really reluctant on getting more knights because I already kind of have them. And uh, I think these... Uh, Melissa and Spearman will join. Hmm. You know, Orders. I will just leave the spear militia there. As you wish. You will join uh, Robert here. And actually I think Robert might go and uh, build some watchtowers around. So because I can, uh, because I can recruit, no, I can't, because that is a castle. So here in this town, when I build, alright. I'm just thinking that's how many how many troops will I leave here in uh, your will sire leave here in Rennes my lord sire my lord sire maybe I will wait for the roads so they can move out from there uh, faster My financial situation isn't too bad. I will go into the negative this turn. I know it, and that's all right. I could get an upgrade here as well. I don't think I will hurry with that. Mm. 
I will take a land clearance here anyway. 1600 would be the conversion to a large town. Now if I commit to this, that I will do it, I should do it now. Maybe, maybe land clearance first. I will take the land clearance first, then uh, I will uh, very much consider that conversion. Uh, Nottingham will remain as a castle for now. Mines will be built, good. Roads. Alright, so everything is okay. Do I need more units or can I get more units? In London. Alright, so I could move uh, some units away from here. Leave my lord. Uh, Your will, sire. Take them to Nottingham. That would leave. All right. Sire. The peasants. Peasants. I might as well put into a put into a fight because I. Uh, they are not free. Free here in town. Anyway. So now London has the units that are free to upkeep there. Okay. Uh, army is building up in Nottingham. Not much of an army, but some kind of an some kind of army. Mm, should I take some of these Orders. knights? Ships ready. Let's take the merchant. Unloading here. my wares, sire. Yes, my liege. Mm. Journeying onward. Tomorrow's journey awaits, sire. I think you will uh, eventually go to that wine. I'll continue once I have rested, sire. My lord. Thinking, should I take some knights? Maybe at least one unit to the continent to help with. Uh, Help with fighting uh, Carnarvon, Dublin, and eventually the Scots. So I probably want to continue here as well. I'm not sure, sir, about these rebel settlements, but if there are any here, I might take them. Might consider those as well. Mm. Your will, sire. But maybe, maybe if I take two units of knights. Yes. yes, I will do it. Mm. Your will, sir. Are you blocking my way to the bridge? Yes, you are. You know what? I uh, I want you away from my lands, French fellow. If I want to march south, south, I can't because this guy is in the way. Not good. Hmm. Oh. Sire, my lord. I will take um... orders, my lord. Hmm. I will take a little army from here and. Uh... Go to the borders here to build a build a watchtower. I think that's that's on our side. Yes, sir. Erecting a watchtower. We can see Paris. Can we see something else? No. Right. I think you can. Uh, 
By your command. Return Continuing next. tomorrow, sire. Return on the next turn. Orders. And then we have the princess. I will take I'll take her to the land. I'm thankful to be back ashore. A lady needs her rest, sire. <laughs> well you take that. Ship's that. ready! And I think I will leave her here. She will do trade agreements and if she finds a suitable Yes sir! Full suitable sale. husband, then so be it. Where to, sire? Spy will keep on spying. With discretion, sire. Those once you continue the siege, yes. that battle will take place. Um, wait, I guess I could put some. Your more. will, sire. Sire, my lord. An order. Orders. Ah, all right. I can't can't get the land units to my help Lord. help Sire. with this uh, Orders. help with this my siege. Lord. Orders. Yes, so that's unfortunate. Yes, Majesty. You will Sire. stay there. You will stay Your will, there. Sire. Fleet ready, Sire. You are there. You can move. Set sail. Ships ready. You are moved. At your service, you Your moved. Majesty. You are ready. Sire. All right. Just wanting to make sure I have uh, I have done everything. So now I have. And uh, let's uh, let's go. Oh, the Scottish diplomat wants to talk to from us. Scotland, noble sire. Trade rights, you say? Well, I will uh, I will ha happily accept that. Uh, but would you be willing to pay for those ones? Like only, only the trade right, so maybe 400? Oh, it's demanding, eh? I guess I can't ask for anything. Hmm. And I'm not really ready to, uh, I don't want to keep map information for the Scots. I will uh, happily accept the uh, trade rights. This seems quite acceptable. It will help. Well, uh, that was uneventful. Good day. <laughs> All right, and the troops from York ride out. The balance of power is on our side. But uh, I will go into the field and fight this fight, and that will be in the next part. So uh, I thank you for watching this video, and I'll see you in the part 3.